Welcome back to another computer sluggish video. Have you subscribed to our YouTube channel yet? If not, be sure to click on the big red subscribe button and click on the bell to get notified when we upload a new video. In today's video, I will be showing you how to run the Windows 10 Driver Verifier Manager. If you are having issues with drivers in Windows 10, then this is a very good way to detect which driver is causing you the issue as it will stress test that driver file and then you will know which one is causing you the issue. To start off with, first you need to open up the start menu and you now need to type in verifier and you now need to click on this option here, run command under verifier and you will now have a window that looks like this. You now need to click on create standard settings and go next. You now have a few different options. For this video, we're going to go ahead and select a driver name from a list. If you are unsure which driver might be causing you the issue, then you may want to select automatically select all drivers installed on this computer. But just remember that test might take a very long time. You can also select the other option, drivers built for older versions of Windows and also the unsigned drivers. We now need to go ahead and press next. And as you can see, there's a massive list of all the drivers that are installed on my PC. It's a good idea just to change the provider to the top so we got the unknown, as these are the drivers that may be causing you issues on your computer. But if you have got a memory dump, I will do another video showing you how to read memory dump files. If you've got a memory dump file, then it will tell you which driver file might be giving you the issue. And then you can then go ahead and test that driver file. And then we will know if that is the driver that's causing you the issue. But it's always a good idea just to go ahead and update the drivers on your computer as it will save you a lot of time and hassle. I'm now going to go ahead and select a random driver file. I'm just going to select this one here. Once you have selected the driver file you want to test, we can go ahead and press finish. You will need to restart your PC or laptop. As you can see, I have been notified to restart my computer. I'm going to go ahead and restart my PC now. Just remember, it might take slightly longer for your computer to boot. And if for some reason you cannot get back into Windows 10, then you might have to boot up into safe mode and then disable the test from happening. So just be careful when running this test. It's a very good way of test driver files, but you could actually end up locking yourself out of Windows 10, which you definitely do not want to do. So this is at your own risk. Once your computer has restarted, we can now open up the driver verifier manager again by opening up the start menu and typing in verifier. You now need to click on display information about the currently verified drivers and press next. And you will now see lots of information about the driver file that we just tested. You can go through and make sure everything is okay. And we can then go ahead and press next. And as you can see, there was no fails or anything. Everything looks good. We can go ahead and press next again. And yeah, it all looks good. We now need to open the driver verifier once more to delete the settings. So it don't keep testing the driver file. To do this, all you need to do is open the start menu again and type in verifier. You now need to click on delete existing settings and press finish. And you now need to press yes. And that's it. I hope this tutorial has helped. If it has, hit the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials. Don't forget to check out my social media channels and forum.